ASU H had provided that? No, we just found out today. Okay, your reaction to that? I, it's an outrage. I don't think that the ASU H has any business in promoting an agenda that it probably knows very little about without any consultation from the students on this campus. So I think that they're just going along with the UH administration and I'm surprised that a student body would think that that's what they need to do with their money. are given a lot of resources and misinformation and they they are doing workshops for for APEC interns so a lot of students are are thinking that APEC is a good thing they're holding the video contest um, with a bunch of pretty decent prizes to get free advertisement for APEC and that's what the APEC night is supposed to be is the awards for the video contest I've um, emailed these people asking what their selection process is, and I've gotten no answers from them. I'm the chair of the art department. If, it, if there's any, if it's a real video contest, we definitely should be the people involved in selecting the videos if they're serious about it being an art contest. Apex sucks. Labor and resources. Apex sucks. Labor and resources. Apex sucks. Labor and resources. Apex sucks. Labor and resources.
lumber industry, and since then, 1.4 million hectares of land per year have been deforested. That's equal to 14 Oahu's deforested a year in the country of Indonesia due to deregulation. That lumber is then used to, for the paper mills, where the toxic chemicals used to break down the lumber uh, flow into the ocean and into the rivers, into the streams. People in the area of Indonesia have had to move from the forests, which were their indigenous homes, and live in slum outskirts of the city where they become a labor force for big corporations. So, you know, think about what it does to the people of the world. A lot has been talked, everybody's been talking about the benefits it's going to bring to Hawaii. The money that tourism, the money of tourism, what it's going to bring to Hawaii. Nobody's really talking about the people around the world, men are in the planet, who are affected by APEC, what it's doing to the environment, what it's doing to labor, what it's doing to human trafficking, which is expanding due to the deregulation of labor. Here it goes, sold, $50. Three hundred now, three and a quarter. Three and a quarter bid now, three seventy-five bid. Three and a quarter bid now, three seventy-five bid. Three seventy-five bid, three seventy-five bid, three seventy-five, three seventy-five bid now, four and a quarter. Four and a quarter on it. He said four and a quarter bid now, four seventy-five. Four and a quarter bid now, four seventy-five bid. Four and a quarter bid now, four seventy-five bid. Four and a quarter bid now, four seventy-five bid. Four and a quarter bid, four seventy-five bid now, five and a quarter. Here's four seventy-five there now, five and a quarter. Four seventy-five bid, five and a quarter there. Five seventy-five, sir. Then get you, then get you, then hey, 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 then get you. Just 
class privilege. And that's something that I acknowledge on a daily basis. And by acknowledging that, I do what I can to reduce oppression and injustices all around the world. Good idea. Go in. <laughs> you want to go in? Go. 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 Yeah.